Hello everybody, here's Switzerland again. I still have <clears throat> somewhat of a cold. As you can see, I have a new cell here. This time I took 316 stainless steel plates, 10 centimeters long, 5.5 wide, and 2 millimeters thick. And the straps I have here in between are those um, cable binders you use to to do like this and <clears throat> the thickness of these is 1.5 millimeters so I have an equal distance I have 3 millimeters uh, depth here to, to go in as you see and then I glued them together they're kept tight I glued them together and as you can see, I have taken uh, the two outer plates and I welded them together. I guess it's the positive. Then I have five neutral plates in between. And then I have one plate as a negative in the middle. And now I will just take it apart here's the cell uh, by the way my English is really rusty I haven't been using it for years so don't worry and my understanding of electricity is practically zero so anything I say about electricity just uh, take it for what it's worth so I have uh, made I try to make four little feet so the cell can stand on its own without touching the surfaces uh, of stainless steel or st something else. This is a plastic thing I put underneath so it won't touch the metal. And here is the cell with the spacing. And what I did here was to put some of that glue around the stainless steel plate in order to insulate it so maybe could be some dispersion when the, the water is in here this is an idea I have maybe it's worth nothing I don't know okay this is the cell so and here is the cell fixed to this lid I have the two electrical attachments. I made an exit for the gas. I drilled a hole through through the screw and this is the container. And here we go. It's very simple. and then I put this in in a bubbler and I will see what happens see you on the production site I went to a friend's place with electronic equipment to test hydrogen production I didn't have the video camera so I took uh, some pictures of the of the event um, what I will do in future I will take a video of the entire production of hydrogen, the voltage, the amperage, and the quantity of hydrogen produced, so we have something to work on. Thank you.